Hello, today's video we have the following content. The Storm Chaser is a hit. I escaped Wang Yibo, but was surprised by the second male lead Wang Yang. CCTV spy drama Storm Chaser is set in the financial industry and presents a unique spy story. The male lead Wang Yibo and the second male lead Wang Yang both gave outstanding performances, especially the role of Shen Tun and played by Wang Yang is deeply rooted in the hearts of the people. Scenes such as the duel over the tariff custody proposal in the plot are shocking, and the relationship between master and apprentice is also highly anticipated. CCTV spy drama Storm Chaser is currently airing on the popular screen. Frankly speaking, after watching many spy TV series, the movie Storm Chaser is undoubtedly the most innovative and visually attractive one. The reason for this is actually quite straightforward, that is, this espionage TV series adopts a very original angle of entry. It turns out that this series is a spy show brought from the financial industry. The background of the story is set on the streets of Shanghai during the Republic of China, and the main content is still spy combat. But this entry point starts with the Kuomintang Central Bank as a reference background. Within the institution of the Central Bank, competition and disputes are like turbulent waves, with hidden conspiracies and undercurrents. This storyline is really creative and very different. But honestly, Storm Chaser has a very unique theme and a very rich and in-depth plot. The acting ability of the actors in the play is indeed outstanding, which is the core factor. I won't go into detail about the male protagonist Wang Yibo. He undoubtedly gave everyone the most outstanding performance in history this time. In the process of shaping the role of the male protagonist Wei Rule, he gradually transformed from a lack of confidence at the beginning to a skilled operation in the central bank, and his performance was quite outstanding. The role of Wei Rule played by Wang Yibo is undoubtedly shocking, but the part that really touches people's hearts is undoubtedly the speech he gave on the scene, which was cheered by people. It was obvious that no message was written on the letter in his hand, only a blank piece of paper. However, he held the letter in his hand and started a long discussion with the people below. The series of speeches that time were truly breathtaking and indeed the highlight of this work. However, after watching 12 episodes of Storm Chaser, I personally feel that the second male lead in the show, Wang Yang, is the most outstanding and the most impressive. Of course, I have some natural filtering effect on Wang Yang. The first time I watched Wang Yang's role as Tang Zijing in celebrating more than years, I was deeply attracted by it. After that, I watched many TV series starring him, such as Rebel, The World in Ming Dynasty Under the Microscope. I have a special liking for Wang Yang's acting talent, so much so that I can't restrain my preference. Wang Yang can express that no matter what kind of plot it is, whether it is the protagonist or the supporting role, there should be no mistakes. Every time he appears, he exudes that special flavor. Once on stage, the experience is immediately apparent. After appreciating Wang Yang's acting skills in the Storm Chaser this time, I deeply feel that he has reached the peak of his acting skills. And in the movie Storm Chaser, those scenes touched my heart the most. One dramatic event certainly involved the showdown over the tariff custody proposal. In this grand dramatic performance, the speech of Wei Rule, played by Wang Yibo, will undoubtedly become the center of attention of the audience and become the most important one. Although there are only a few small details, Shen Tun and played by Wang Yang successfully attracted Wei Rule's attention and took away his original limelight. When he clearly realized that Mr. Yu had arranged for a killer to follow him. Still he climbed into the car without hesitation. Even when faced with desperate situations or desperation, he could still maintain his composure. The Storm Chaser has been well received after it was aired. Wang Yibo, Li Qin, and Wang Yang performed delicately and with tension. Spy war dramas and business war dramas have always been the types of dramas that audiences like to watch. If the two are perfectly unified to create a thrilling and fascinating story, it will undoubtedly be the most attractive to the audience. Storm Chaser is such an intriguing drama. What a show! Directed by Yao Ziya Fen, starring Wang Yibo, Li Qin, and Wang Yang, and co-starring Zhang Shiana Yang, Wang Zuki, and Galu, The Storm Chaser has been aired since its start up and interlocking plots, with movie-like scenes. The quality and the actor's delicate and intense performances have won a very good reputation from the audience, and the ratings have been rising again and again. In the 1930s, when warlords were fighting and the people were in dire straits, patriotic young man Wei Rule, played by Wang Yibo, applied for a job at the central bank and met the brothers Shen Tunin, played by Wang Yang, and Shen Jinshen, played by Li Qin. Shen Tunin served as a consultant to the central bank. He launched a series of reforms to the central bank. 
He admired Wei Rulei's talent and ability very much. Wei Rulei lived up to his high expectations and provided suggestions and suggestions to Shen Tunan's reforms, and became Shen Tunan's effective assistant. As Shen Tunan's sister, Shen Jin is fair and beautiful, plays the piano well, and is secretly an espionage agent of our party. Under the guidance of Shen Jin's Han, Wei Ruolei finally became a member of the Communist Party and embarked on a bright road. Shen Tunan is in the Kuomintang camp, holds an important position in the central bank, and has the support of the Song family in the Nanjing government. He has both status and support. Because the national treasury is empty, he has to adopt the strategy of annexing other banks to lose soldiers and protect his car. Because the reforms he implemented touched the interests of other interest groups, many people wanted to get rid of him. So there were always pairs of vicious eyes peeping at Shen Tunin around him, and a business war of swords and swords was staged. What Shen Tunin didn't expect was that his sister Shen Jin's Hun was in the opposite camp to him, joined the Communist Party, and was also an espionage agent hiding around him to spy on commercial secrets. Wei Rulei, whom he admired, was later instigated by his sister, and Shen Jin's Han although she is a female, she can fly over walls and climb walls with accurate marksmanship. She has served as a sniper many times and completed assassination operations on her own. She also quickly eliminated traitors. The frequent activities of the Communist Party frightened and hated the enemy. Although there were traitors to help, they were eventually eradicated by the enemy's anti-trafficking team. This made Ling Kaiya Song, the captain of the detective team, very angry. His superiors scolded him mercilessly and even used force against him. He was tortured and made Ling Kaiya Song miserable. In order to save Shen Tunan who was shot and injured, his sister Shen Jin's Han ignored her anemia and almost fainted when she gave her brother a blood transfusion. Wei Ruolei learned that he had the same blood type as Shen Tunan and volunteered to donate blood for him. Shen Tunan was saved, and in his heart he understood that it was his sister and Wei Ruolei who gave him a second life through a blood transfusion. This friendship moved him deeply. Galu got the title of the national sister-in-law because she played the gentle and considerate sister-in-law in the drama Everything is Fine. This time she played the role of Shen Tunan's wife, which made the audience shine. Galu was wearing a Republican Chong Sam. Liu, not only has good looks but also temperament. No wonder Shen Tunan takes great care of her. Wang Yang, an actor born in Harbin, is an out-and-out -out northeastern man, with exquisite and stylish facial features, handsome and tall appearance, especially those eyes that can talk, every word, every action, every frown, every gesture. Comma they are all so perfect. When people saw Wang Yang appear, they stared at the screen intently, fearing that no details were left behind. Wang Yibo was a musician before his debut, but he never imagined that he could be as good at acting as he is at singing. The character Wei Ruolei he played went from a novice who just entered the workplace to a confident and talented financial expert. Unsurprisingly, although some viewers complained about his paralyzed face and stiff expression, and that he was not as free as Wang Yang in terms of performance, it did not affect his performance in the play. As for the acting skills of other actors, Wang Zuki is worthy of being a veteran actor. Although he is in his 60s, his acting skills are still current, and he vividly interprets the composure and loyalty of our underground workers to the party. The most hated character is Ling Kaiya Song, the captain of the detective team. When he tortured the suspicious elements, his eyes were as fierce as a jackal. He once brazenly showed off, after learning that his classmate was a communist, he was trying to arrest him. I felt a little uneasy before, so I invited my classmate to dinner, but then I skinned him. How could such a devil not be hated to the bone? Zhang Shiana Yang, who plays Lin Kaiya Song, was born in Dongshan City, Hebei Province. He is a powerful actor. From the evil H.U. Oda in the TV series The Legend of the Condor Heroes to Lin Kaiya Song in The Storm Chaser, we have seen Zhang Shiana Yang's role. The tension of the villain, playing the villain is often more proof of the actor's superior skills. The reason why the Storm Chaser is favored by netizens is not only because of its good script, but also because of the outstanding performances of actors such as Wang Yang, Li Qin, Wang Yibo and Zhang Shiana Yang with superb acting skills. Are you following this show? Which actor do you think performed this drama well? Everyone is welcome to leave comments and messages.